Right, so Gintama, Gintama this week was two a actual two contained episodes which focus on two different things, all focused technically on summer as a theme, but they were two vastly different episodes. Well, the first episode, or the first half, centred on um, Soyo, the um, Shogun's sister, and Watermelons, and she got captured, and then in the end, there's a life lesson in there somewhere, and yeah, it was kind of a funny, it was funny, because it was... So yeah, con con constantly did the wrong thing and got more into trouble, and then she thought she got napped by the police when there weren't. They are were actually thieves, and then it all cycled from then. It was actually quite a funny episode. Also, somewhere in there was a life lesson. I can probably imagine that somewhere in there was a life lesson. Can't figure it out, but there was. And then the second half was about Sata and having to finish off his homework for summer. And yeah, it's kind of it's kind of like that kind of fourth wall break in a way, because it's like someone has to finish their, their summer homework somewhere in the world who's watching this episode, so it kind of makes sense. And yeah, there's also a constant reference to Lupita, Lupita, I can't ever pronounce that name, Lupita and the Castle in the Sky. Like, there was a constant reference to it, it was actually quite funny. And it was just constantly, unless you actually understood the film, or where it came from, or where the reference came from, you wouldn't understand what was going on. It took me a long time to realise what they were actually talking about, and then when he said the cast from the sky, I realised it was a Ghibli film. I was like, oh! And then from there it got quite funny, because in the end, Hintoke kind of ripped off Satan, and they had to watch um, Clouds the whole time, waiting for the cast from the sky to appear. And yeah, it was a, it was a very, very funny um, episode in the long run. It's more, there's, it's less action. Well, there was action in the first half, and then there was less action in the second half. But I like the Sator episodes because they all have really, really nice endings and they all have really nice messages. And they're kind of nice because it's all family orientated. It's all just really, really nice in the long run. And yeah, I mean, I want, a, I want another arc to happen because the arcs are really good. I'm figuring out maybe, possibly, in the next couple of weeks, there might be another arc because there's only three weeks left until the next half, next part of the season starts. So. I'm guessing that maybe somewhere there has to be a new arc in that bit. Maybe the episode 24 might be the start of the new arc, because it kind of looks that way. But, I mean, yeah, it's a good episode. It had it had a nice messages. It basically just carried on. It was not... It didn't grind it to a halt into, like, a filler episode, which I'm guessing these are filler episodes. They're not technically story oriented episodes, so I'm guessing they're filler. But they're good filler. I don't, I'm, not, I'm not too begrudged of it. It's not a One Piece filler where it lasts, like, ten years, and it's just... Come on, please his end. I want to go back to the action. Yeah, but I mean, it's good. But with all that said, I have been Driver, and I'll see you guys later. Bye for now.